It's been in my family for over 40 years. I don't know anything about the piece itself. My parents had portraits made of themselves a long time ago, and my mother was wearing this in the portrait. And ever since then, it's been disappeared into the safe deposit box, and I inherited it. I just want to know something about it. Oh, excellent. My father once mentioned that it was Russian. Now, I don't know uh, where he learned that, but it looks to me like it could be uh, French or Italian. It's, it's really an unusual piece, and I just... It definitely has a continental feel to you, though. Yes. Okay. Well, in the portrait, where was she wearing it? Around her neck. She was wearing yes, it around her neck. Yes. How interesting. Because that's not where it should be. Really? It is a scent bottle. So right. this is something that would have been worn off of what is known as a chatelaine. And this would have been part of an, a whole uh, accessory group that a, a very fashionable woman would have worn. This was probably made around 1880, and it is French. What is the material that you think it's made from? It looks like it's porcelain, obviously. Actually, it's not. The colorful part here is enamel on metal. There is a small signature down here. Uh, on the other side here, there's a other very, very nice scene, and it is made with 18 karat or higher yellow gold. I notice the chain is heavy. Is the chain itself gold as well? The chain is gold. The mounts are gold. What it doesn't have are any marks on it, which is really interesting, which right. is why I had to test it. Now, probably this ring here at the top has been replaced. Okay. That's where the mark might have been, but it's not there. Okay. So the metalwork is really exquisitely chased, finished. It has a different color gold around the outside. It right. has a green tinge to it, which is really nice. It's called bicolor gold. Okay. Ever had it appraised? Never had it appraised. At auction today, that would probably bring around $7,000 to $9,000. Wow. That's great.